Television is the menace that everyone loves to hate but can't seem to live without in today's times. Namaste. My name is Adwan Singh and today I'll be sharing my thoughts on how screen and the virtual world has become a boon in today's new normal. Look where I am stuck in a box saying my TED ad speech. If I was in school during pre-COVID times, I could move around and express myself even more. But here I am looking for the perfect lighting and in the perfect spot recording my speech. But despite that, I will still be able to share my views with all of you. In today's times, screen and the virtual world has become a necessity and a blessing too. Where COVID-19 has taken over the world, it has forced all of us to be in front of some sort of a screen, be it laptop, iPad, mobile phone, or even a television. If you think about a couple of months back, you'd have heard everyone talking about the pitfalls of increasing screen time. And even my views were biased, but current times have made me rethink. While gadget use leads to obesity, affects our eyesight, and leads to lesser reading, and all of these affect our academics. But what about today? Today, it has helped everyone remain connected, helped students like me continue education through online classes. It has brought in a new culture of work from home. Media has been able to communicate with us with timely updates and information. It has helped us cope up with uncertain times too. While many family members can watch their favorite movies and programs, like elder family members can watch their favorite movies and programs, and parents of even younger kids can simulate themselves through online activities and webinars. The best part was I got to celebrate my grandmother's birthday using Zoom, as we could not go to meet her. So thank God for the technology, as I could have not been a part of the, her very special day. And most of all, what got me to change my views was when I was watching an interview of a COVID patient who had been home isolated for 15 days. He said, so thank God for the TV in my room. I could watch my favorite movies and favorite programs I've always wanted to watch. And I learned a little bit of cooking using YouTube. I read my favorite books using the virtual libraries. Now this helped him recover well from his illness. And he said, the days went by like a breeze. In today's testing times, where millions are suffering from this virus, this could be the story of them too. I would like to close by saying, just like a cord has two sets, screen is that millions live through a, a boredom and loneliness and has helped them come out stronger than ever. Thank you.